So, I'm Turi, and I'm the CEO and the founder of Demotics. Demotics.com, we call ourselves a streetwire. Um, one of the things which, is, which we always get asked about is, what's the difference between a professional and an amateur? What's, a, what's this citizen journalism malarkey? And we've kicked that term straight out of any usage of us. We call, we call what we do street journalism. What it is, it's views from the ground up. It's not top down. It's not the editor of Newsweek or the Sunday Times saying, we're interested in X, Y, or Z. It's not. It's locals, wherever they are, um, telling the stories which they think are important. And this is one of the things which, we can, which tech allows us finally to do, is that because we have this fantastic tool called the web, we can be locals, often professionals in the case of Demotics, are telling stories which only they know about. Um, and they're telling them in a way that, they, that no editor in the Western media sort of the dominant hegemonic media would ever have heard about. So what we're able to do is to take an enormous variety of content, whether it's fantastic top-level professionals in India or in Botswana or in Cambodia who don't have access to the mainstream media, and push them to that media in an instant, immediate way without countless brokers, without countless deals. And two, also, of course, real sort of pro-amateurs who've got, who are just interested in t t telling, telling stories who, by using demotics, become more and more, in a sense, professional. They get better and better at it. The critical issue for us is this ground-up street reporting. It's all about um, the decisions of what's reported are in the hands of the people on the ground. And it's, this also has a massive impact on the way news is told. For the longest period of time, the only news which was being told in the Western media was from Western correspondents going abroad and telling those local stories from a Western perspective. The joy now is that professionals and amateurs, anyone, in these localities are able to tell their stories from their perspectives, which is exactly what global news should be about.